Hello everyone, it's Ross here from Xbox Gamer Reviews. Today we're looking at Super Party Sports Football. It's developed and self-published by Handy Games. It uh, originally was a mobile game. Uh, we received rave reviews on there. It uh, didn't do too bad itself. We reviewed it recently. Um, and that will be in the description below, the link to that, if you want to check that out. And uh, yeah, we'll get started. And as you can see, here you can choose many, many different uh, national teams. And obviously I'm going to be choosing England and find them. There we go. Um, here is also you know, unlockable items. It's all in-game currency. There's no microtransactions at all with this game. Um, silly outfits from bunny rabbits to you know, skeleton outfits, mummies. I'm just going to stick to the standard kit here. Um, and again, you know, there's ranges from 1 to 10 cups each having around 10 levels in each so you know about 100 levels in total uh, it starts off really really easy in the first cup um, I'm currently halfway through and as you can see by the trophies I've received there like it's this does start to get difficult I will start off with the first one and show you how easy it is to start off with pretty much is a um, tutorial level in itself um, here look we've got the um, different unlockables again you use the in-game currency um, this ball here you use a bit later on when you start to get the, the bigger opponents and the referees on pitch. Um, this ball here um, on the right will be giving you extra time so you normally get around three seconds added to your time limit per enemy defeat and I think this gives you about five and um, we'll just start off with the free ball here. They're pretty simple up some on-screen text telling us some stuff there and you just literally aim with the ball with the left stick and shoot it with the A button. Um, once you defeat all the enemies, as you can see here, you now get a flaming ball and you can take a shot on goal. Um, once it comes back down, that is all. And there we go. Level finished. The whole aim of the game there is to finish the level within a set time limit left on the screen. So there, I've, got, I've scored 36 seconds left, which, you know, above the 30 second marker for three trophies. And then you move on to the next level. It's pretty simple, really. There's a second cup, so you know it gradually adds things in. You know, as we mentioned in the review, it's a bit of Angry Birds mixed with worms. Um, I hope everybody else can can see that like we did when we when we took a look at it. Um, it's not a bad little game, really, to be honest. Oh, I completely missed that one there. <laughs> I mean, uh, cost-wise, it's it's three ninety nine um, when it's released on the fourth of December, um, which you know it's not bad at all, really. I mean, again, it was mentioned in our review that it'll be you know a good little stocking filler for Christmas. Great game to play with the kids. You know, it's nothing too gory, nothing too scary, or nothing too complicated. Um, so yeah, I'll just complete this level if I can, <laughs> and show you one of the later levels where the difficulty ramps up somewhat. Yeah, this this pretty straightforward aim aim with the left stick and shoot. <clears throat> there we go, another level completed. Alright, so I'll back out now to the oh I'll click restart there. Didn't mean to do that. Let's pause it quickly. Back to the main menu. Back out again. Let's choose one of these. Let's do one I've not done too well on so far. Let me show you how you know, the difficulty rises somewhat. There we go, you can see on this we you know there's a referee kicking around. Um, he will give you a yellow card if you hit him with the ball. If you just spot you in that field of vision you've got there when you take out one of your opponent it opponents he will give you a red card and that player that was caught will be removed from the game making it a little bit more difficult. Let's try and uh, angle this a bit better. There you go. Yeah, you can use edges. There you go, like that, like so, you know, bounce the ball around a little bit. This is one of the other pickups you can get in game. That has now given me the knockout ball, which is a spike ball which 
you know, takes out opponents straight away. These opponents here, the standard ones, oh, and it takes out the ref too. The standard opponents, they'll be taken out with one shot anyway, but later on you'll, you'll find enemies that are um, a lot bigger um, and take more hits. There's also these opponents that wear the hats, this one here. You know, a bit similar to plants versus zombies, um, where, you know, the zombies come on with... Um, uh, traffic cones on the heads and stuff and they take more hits to you know kill them it's a similar thing there I think we managed to nab an achievement there as well score 100 goals so yeah there we go that's you know nice little achievement set there's, there's achievements for um, completing all the cups you know, individual achievements for those um, and other random bits and bobs. I can't really see the full achievement list yet as it's not fully released title. There's a nice bit of an early access and once again thanks to Handy Games for getting in touch with us to review this game for them. Um, and that pretty much wraps it up. You know, looking for a nice game to um, play with the kids during the, the Christmas holidays. Um, something for somebody's stocking filler at £3.99. You can't really go wrong. Um, even if you just fancy a, something a bit of a break from the games that are out at the minute, Fallout, um, Star Wars, you know, just a bit of a break from those, chuck it on, 5-10 minutes, and away you go. Right, that's it for this. Uh, thanks for watching. Hope you've enjoyed. Please do subscribe for more. We are a fairly new channel, and we are trying to, you know, provide content for you guys to enjoy, and we'll see you soon. Take care.